The Mossad Aesthetic Space Ruler, MESR, is a multifunctional measuring device for use with both edentulous and dentate patients. The measurements obtained through the use of the ruler provide essential information for determining treatment plans, predicting aesthetic outcomes, and also describing a patient's oral topography using currently accepted guidelines. The Mossad Aesthetic Space Ruler is constructed of clear plastic, allowing for complete visualization of the underlying oral structures. The ruler is angled for ease of placement in both maxillary and mandibular arches. It's notched on both ends for patient comfort when placed in contact with the vestibular frena. The ruler has dimples placed at 1 mm increments as well as horizontal lines at 5 mm increments for precision in viewing and marking the position of the anatomic features. The finished surface of the ruler is easily marked with a fine point indelible marker. Step-by-step -step instructions. Dentate usage. Upper lip, incisal edges, and gingiva at rest. Ask the patient to open the mouth with teeth apart and to hold that position without flexing any facial muscles. Place the long end of the ruler centered in the full depth of the maxillary anterior vestibule, taking care not to compress the vestibular tissue. Note the notch in the ruler will be placed over the anterior frenum. Using a fine-tipped indelible marker, mark the vertical position of the resting upper lip as well as the vertical position of the maxillary central incisor teeth. If the patient presents with a gummy display, the position of the gingival line can be marked. Upper lip smile line. With a patient smiling, a marker is used to mark the highest position in the upper smiling lip as well as the incisal edges of the anterior teeth. The gingival line can also be marked on patients with an excessive gummy display. Lower lip, incisal edges, and gingiva at rest. Place the short end of the ruler centered in the full depth of the mandibular vestibule over the anterior frenum without compressing the vestibular tissue. The position of the resting lip as well as the position of the central incisors are marked on the ruler with a fine marker. If excess gingiva is showing, mark this gingival position also. Lower lip smiling. With the patient smiling, the lower lip's vertical position is marked on the ruler with a fine marker as well as the position of the incisal edges of the mandibular anterior teeth. Again, the gingival line is marked in gummy display situations. These measurements provide the dentist with crucial information relating the patient's lips, teeth, and gingival display to the overall facial mask. This allows for optimal cosmetic design in the final prosthetic restoration and a means to communicate his information to patients at the initial examination and how this will impact the final aesthetic result. Further, the dental laboratory technician can utilize these readings to assist in prosthesis design. Edentulous Usage of the Aesthetic Space Ruler For the edentulous maxillary patient, the Mossad Aesthetic Space Ruler gives the practitioner the ability to fully evaluate the palatal height in reference to the shortest ridge height, which directly relates to the amount of retention that can be achieved in a denture prosthesis. This measurement can be quantified for classification purposes such as class 1, 2, 3, or 4 going from the best to the least ridge condition. Class 1, 21 mm or greater height. Class 2, 10 to 20 mm height. Class 3, 11 to 15 mm height. And class 4, 10 mm height or less. The short end of the ruler is placed at the highest point at the palatal vault and measured by a mark placed on the ruler to coincide with the shortest height of the residual maxillary ridge. Additionally, the height of the maxillary ridge can be measured from the vestibule to the shortest height of the ridge. The reading obtained provides the ACP ridge classification which can be a predictor of prosthetic success. For the edentulous mandibular patient, 
The space ruler is utilized to quantify the lowest ridge height. Place the short end of the ruler in the vestibular depth without compressing the vestibular tissue and measure to the height of the ridge. The numerical reading relates to the complexity of the overall final prosthetic. Class 1, 2, 3, and 4 going from the best to the least ridge condition. The Mossad Aesthetic Space Ruler, an innovative diagnostic tool for optimizing aesthetic prosthesis design.